So basically, I'm currently making this video, even though there's no video, as a way of keeping track of my progress, I guess. Um, I'm looking to lose as much weight as I possibly can between now and July. So currently it's the 17th, which gives me about four and a half months. Let's say, let's say five, five straight months. Um, currently my routine is getting up. If I don't have to go to work, um, I go to the gym. I'm on a rowing machine for about half an hour. I go running for about another half an hour after that. And it's a combination of like running and then just kind of walking to recover, running, walking to recover for about half an hour. So about five minute intervals and then eating a salad and some chicken for lunch and then for dinner kind of eating just whatever I want which ultimately I'm thinking that's not a good idea mainly because it's like it's it's almost an excuse to eat whatever you want and that's really not the goal so basically I'm looking to get married and I want to be in the best possible shape I can be um Currently, I weigh 215, and my ideal goal would be to lose at least 25 pounds. I'm, I'm shooting for 40, but 25 is a little bit more reasonable, I believe. Um, some big like impediments I see for myself is I love drinking soda, and I know cutting out sugar is such a huge deal, but it's just so hard sometimes, you know? Sometimes you just want a Coke. Sometimes you just want a Pepsi. And I have to learn to cut hard on it. And it'll be like the hardest, like the first week. And then after that, it's like gravy. But like, it's that first week that's always the hardest, you know? And I'm looking, I'm looking at my exercise routine. And I think I need to add some more, probably about half an hour. So I'm looking for about an hour and a half at the gym. Um, alternating between heavier days and lighter days, kind of like one day is nothing but nothing but cardio based exercises, and then another day more. I guess it would be like weightlifting or something something along that lines. But ultimately, I'm kind of doing this just so I can talk about it and talk about how I feel and talk about how I want to strive to do better and I want to strive to be better. It's just, it's very difficult sometimes, mainly because I really don't have anyone to talk about, about this with me, because, well, my girlfriend, she's relatively good shape. I'm kind of overweight, not tremendously overweight, but it's just, I need to, you know, you just need to lose more weight. Um, my mother's in good shape. My father's in good shape. My brothers are in good shape. I'm just kind of, I'm kind of the odd one out and... And I just want to prove it to myself that I can do it. And that's the important part is proving you can do something that's hard. You know, it's not going to be easy to do that. I know that for sure. I'm going to struggle with it on a daily basis. But I'm willing to do it because it's important. You know, it's like it's super important. Not only just for your health, but like for you as a person, you know, to say, hey, I'm going to take this challenge and I'm going to do it, right? And that's what I want to do. I want to see if I can challenge myself and actually do something. And and I know I've done it before. I've gotten under 200 pounds before, which was a huge deal. But like, but I couldn't maintain it, mainly because I had bad eating habits and I still do. So hopefully I can improve it a little bit. I can change it a little bit. Um, you know, it'd be nice to hear some advice from other people. You know, I go on Reddit and I read all the stuff and I see pictures of people who dedicated like to something strong and see them drop like 40, 50 pounds. And I'm just like, you know, I can probably do that. I just have to try. And that's ultimately what I'm going to do. I'm going to try, but I would love, you know, 
I guess, a push in the right direction and hopefully maintain this blog and, you know, sticking to it and, you know, just reporting to someone, I think ultimately would help me very well. Well, very well, very much to be accountable to someone, you know, you have goals and there's someone there who wants you to push those goals. I mean, my girlfriend, she says she likes the way I look, but and I know, I know that's true, but like, I want to look better for her and for myself. So this is what I'm going to try and do. I'm going to try and stick to my plans. I'm going to try to work out more consistently. I'm going to try to maybe do it twice a day, you know, just a little bit. Like if I'm going running, you know, maybe run like half an hour here. At, I got a little elliptical machine here. Maybe use that. Um, just focus on eating healthier overall. And cutting out sodas, oh my god, it's gonna be so hard. It really will be. But, yeah, that's ultimately what I plan on doing, and hopefully, I can achieve it. And I can maybe put up a video next time with just me, and what I look like, and my weight loss, and keep track of it, and, you know. I think that'll be good to see, you know, because it's one thing to, like, exercise and like the scale says you dropped five pounds it's another thing to see it and i think that's important for people like that's why people give up because they don't see it they don't see a change like in the mirror because they you know you're so used to seeing yourself you don't see what you used to look like as opposed to what you look like now um unless you have like dramatic weight loss then that's different but like five ten pounds is you know it's noticeable but like i think you have to see it you have to see it, like, not in a mirror, but, like, in front of you. Like, before, after. Right? So, I'll probably end up sending a camera next time. And probably going to do this, like, every Friday or so. And just put my face on camera and just just to see what I look like. And then go from there. So, hopefully someone end up watching this. And we'll see where it goes. <laughs>